Hello guys and welcome back to Comet and this time it's time for the last part of the Minecraft crafting system tutorial. So we'll just jump straight in the scene and create a new scene um, just because it's uh, better to explain it with that. And uh, the very first thing we are going to do is add the script and we are going to put it right here. Um, this for me, uh, for me it's kind of hard to actually do this tutorial because I can't actually copy it from anything. So if there are going to be any errors halfway uh, this part, just wait till the end of this episode and uh, probably it's fixed. Um, because uh, if you're just uh, five minutes in this tutorial and there is an error um, and you comment in my video, uh, um, at my video and you say that there is an error, it could be, it's because of that. So just to say that, um, so we are going to create a UI. Uh, first we're going to create a canvas of course, and we are going to set this to screen space camera. Um, we are going to set this to scale with screen size and we are going to set, put this as the camera. Uh, just some basic uh, settings. Um, and now we are going to add uh, in total nine images, we are going to call them slot one and so on. So we're just going to uh, put them first in the right spot. Um, let's say we want to have them by 50 by 50, just something like that. Oh, and you see also I forgot to import my images to test it. So we are going to do it with some, uh, some basic images that I don't cut uh, anywhere else. Well, I will just cut this video halfway through and we'll just import uh, the images. I think that's a little bit smarter. Um, that's a perfect spot. So we will uh, copy it a few times. So first time, and we're just going to move it a little bit to the right, or a little bit to the right. I took this place. This will also, uh, every time this takes a little bit, but I think it's not that big of a problem. There are only nine of them, and we don't have to do it perfect, or at least I don't need to do it perfect because it's only a tutorial and not for a final project. So that's why I just do it very quickly and don't really care about the perfect place. We are also going to duplicate it one more time and we are going to create this one final. Um, and we are going to add, um, yeah, this will probably fit. We are going to add uh, a text. That's not true. We are going to add <laughs> um, an input field and we are going to call it slot one. Again, you probably uh, need to change the width to, let's say, 50. And again, I'm not going to care anything about uh, the graphics because uh, that will take too much time, actually, um, for this tutorial. Because I want to make the tutorials as short as possible, uh, just because you will probably change it uh, in your own game a lot. Um, or at least I hope so, because it's not really the, the, the most beautiful layout. And now we will assign everything. So we are going to go to this place. Items, we have to do that later. Craftable items, also craft slots. We are going to put here nine. And we're just going to assign uh, one of them actually, the first one, and we're going to make it to one again. This is most time how I do this very quickly. Um, and I'm just going to quickly assign everything. Uh, the result, we also want that one. Uh, that's this one, final, result, whatever. Um, 
And here we are going also going to add one at first. We are going to assign slot one. This is just my the quickest way I think to assign all those uh, those lists. And this this same way. Oh, the wrong one. This is the same way I do it. Uh, this is the way I do it always. Uh, and I think it it works pretty well. Um, you have to make sure though that you don't assign the wrong one. Uh, to the to the list uh, I will just quickly cut this out I will just import all the images and we will go on and I'm back guys uh, sorry for the weird cut by the way and sorry I forgot to import all those images uh, I just got the basic X uh, a wooden cube thing uh, some metal a sword and the X sign UE um, this is the one we are going to use for the empty slot. Um, it's a bit weird sign, I know that, um, but it's not. It's just because it's not uh, a real project. It's just uh, to show how you need to work with this. So that's why this is a bit uh, different from normal. Um, well, I guess. It's maybe a bit smart so we can actually see them to use a knob. Um, it's also looking pretty weird, but I think you uh, you guys understand it. So also here at the exact same image. That's important, that's very important. Uh, otherwise you will get some weird uh, results. Now we need to create um, some items first. Um, so we are going to assign in total four items. The first one is going to be called the sword and we are going to assign also the sword to it. Um, the second one is going to call wood, whatever, um, just assigned in the random, random, uh, randomly. Um, this is going to call metal and metal and this one is going to call, uh, I'm going to call it X. And now we are going to make craftable items. Uh, we are going to link them to each other. And how you're going to do this is just by playing it actually. Um, you're just going to add, for example, um, wood. You want to have a sword, for example. Uh, this one is the second. So this is an ID two, two. Oh, it's crafting. I have to assign that though. Uh, and some wood. So. As you can see, this is a sword. Uh, now you're going to go to the current craft ID. You are going to copy it. You're going to go out of the play screen. And now you go to the craftable items and you're going to add sword. The item ID is zero and we are going to add it. Uh, now we're also going to make an X. So you are going to put here, oh, it's crashing again. <laughs> Um, some metal around here and here some wood so this is an, uh, an X you are going to copy this you are going to add another craftable item um, you are going to name it X item ID 3 and you are going to paste it the real ID in here and now it should work um, so for example I do this and I have to assign this crafting again as you can see in the X, if I remove this and I change this to two, it's a sword. So it works and that's it actually. Uh, if you've got any questions, please ask below in the comment section. Um, if you've got any requests for the other tutorials, also put it in the comment section below. Um, I'm not sure if I'm, going, if I'm able to create it, if I've got enough time and so on, but I will do my best. Um, also, if you liked it, please leave a like or a subscribe. Um, and well, I uh, I hope you guys can uh, are able to uh, to put this in your game. I'm uh, of course very. Uh, if you got it in your game, please uh, please show it to me. That's always fun to uh, to see it in other games. Um, that's it, guys. Um, if you want me to create things like uh, like how it works in Minecraft. Like they can just click this and put it there and so on. 
also put it in the comment section if there are enough requests i will probably do a tutorial over it uh, over it within a few months um, because i also have some other tutorials i want to do and that was it so i hope you guys liked it if you did please leave a like or subscribe and I'll see you guys soon